Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Jeremy. Welcome back to more of Mega Man X2. We've got two of the regular bosses to take on today, and maybe we'll get into the finale, maybe we won't, we'll see. But first things first, we're going to take on Energy and Crystal stage with Crystal Snail. Need to take him out with the Crystal, not Crystal, a Magnet Mine. And um, yes, uh, this is my second attempt at attempting him. I just figured it's easiest to condense the attempt into one thing. Because, oh my god, it took forever for me to clear the stage first try, even though it shouldn't have. So we have visited here a few times in this series now. It's it's kind of weird how it's worked, where I've gone, because of the excellent as I've gone to stages I normally wouldn't have otherwise. So, oh, okay, I didn't realize you could charge stuff up with that guy, but also, can I? Okay, so I can break those guys. Good to know. Either way, oh, we don't, we don't need to try and bring him with us this time. <laughs> Anyway, so we've already played this like very opening beginning part of the stage, you know? So we can climb up here, but obviously uh, don't have no need to go to the X Buster X Hunter room. And there's nothing particularly there which is screaming required. And so I can blast that out the sky and then we have a quick little bit of a dash and a jump. Sets us on the right path. Okay. Well, I'm so I'm gonna try and keep my eye out for hidden areas, but I don't know what the score on that will be. Um, also, this is the mini boss. It's really annoying. I'm like, you can get it. It just takes forever. I I've noticed that a few more stages than the last game have had mini bosses in this time. Um, but yeah, no, the general thing is just charge up shots and hit it um, while dodging as much as these guys can throw at you. Which um, gets a bit more difficult here, but if you're able to just tank it on these invincibility frames, it goes down soon enough. Um, no reimbursement for the health they took there. Uh, oh, okay, this guy is making an act. Ooh. Although, can I dash back up here? I can't. I was trying to see, I was thinking maybe I could see if there was something um, up, up above, but I don't think there is. Either way, let's um, blast you guys. Um, again, though, I say they're my favorite enemy, enemy from Rex 1. Like, these guys did give me a solid headache for a while, but, you know. At the very least, they're easy to defeat and like go down easy enough. <laughs> As easy as one can expect things to go down. Now, if I can actually take these guys out before this slide, so you do a little bit of a slidey slide, don't you, mon friend? And if I were to climb up here, oh ho ho ho! There's nothing hidden up here, though. It's just another hidden area for the sake of being hidden, which I'm not all too big a fan of. Um, either way, I believe we are actually coming up towards the end of the thing. Um, level, well, I, I could be wrong, but. Um, it, I, it was 10 minutes since the last attempt, so do forgive me if I have a minor inaccuracy. I apologize. So they want me to jump down in here and like, they really want you to risk your life for some of these um, platforming segments, I tell you. Either way, we're at the boss room. It doesn't take too long at all to know the stage way out. Again, those excellent visits, even though we didn't go all the whole way into the stage, definitely helped. Now, of course, this is going to be the death run. I want to see and explain how he works. So once he finishes his very, 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 very long introduction, his, um, well, the time you have to attack him with is really slim. So, um, so we can shoot him like that. Now he does this. So he sh those things he shot out, if they hit you, will um, turn you to ice. And when he turns you to ice, it is basically free hit for him when he does this. He spins around and walks onto your location, like so. Which isn't phenomenal. But without fail, he will always do his uh, little spin thing. But as you can see, not phenomenal, and sometimes they'll make it a two-for-one special, which we ain't too big a fan of. But also, the attack frames you get on him are really small. So this is me now trying to, like, wiggle out, get get, get good. Obviously, Magnet Mind does a bit more, and to an end, it's really cool how it works, but that's that's the version with the x Buster. you know, us getting wrecked, essentially. Now, you need to be kept sparing with these, because he's really easy to go through your whole supply on, like, one or two attempts. But, spawn in, my little man. So, we need to be close to him when we hit him, because otherwise if we fire at him, he'll hide in his shell. On top of that, his spinning attack frame stuff, there's not much we can do about it. Just need to make sure that, like, his actual body is out of his shell. So, for example, right there, we've shocked him, and if we jump on a wall, you'll notice he will slam into the wall and take additional little bits of damage. Which isn't too bad, I dare say. So, again, we can hit him, like, here. Now, you'll notice he has uh, really slowed us down. Um, yeah, he can do that occasionally. I don't know what Mega Man power that is, the you know, power of time travel apparently, but it is how it is. Um, we just need to kind of wait out his, um, his BS to an end. So he's going to do that, we're going to do our best to fire him, and he's going to freak out and slam into the wall, which deals that tiny bit extra damage, which to an end we need. So, no, it's now he's at half health, he's going to go a tad bit faster, but it's fine, we hit him, jump on the wall, to make sure we don't get hit as well, and you notice know, he takes a lot more damage. 
Now, again, in my initial attempt, this was all very slowed down. Well, not slowed down, but um, the discovery aspect of it was. But just being able to get him to slam into the wall like that and not take damage. Oh, it saves so much. Now, we want to try and stay far away from here. Oh, no. So he's doing electric again. We climb up here. He is one shot from death. So, um, yeah. You may notice when we shoot him with the magnet mine, he's actually a lot less prone to um, doing the ice thing, which is quite weird. But that's him done. Blitz through. Easy peasy. And again, I only had like one attempt on him before because it took forever for me to get past those sliding block segments. They kept catching me out. But for just under six minutes onto the new recording, I will happily take his defeats. Hell to the air. So that's one down. Um, one more to go in terms of basic missions. So, you got the Crystal Hunter. Okay, I was expecting it to be anything else, but Crystal Hunter works. We aren't going to save them. I should also mention, we're going to go defeat the next boss with our current upgrades. And then I'm going to go run off and go get some upgrades. And we're going to try and tackle the final boss. Well, sec section of final boss levels. Uh, we will have to rematch with some of these guys as well. So it'll be uh, an interesting match at once we've got all the level ups. I, will, I would make an episode out of me going to collect the upgrades. But it's nothing really that exhilarating, unfortunately. So, uh, yeah, I may have to miss some of them as well. Um, we'll see how it pans out, you know? Either way... So, obviously, we've played this portion of the level already, which I, f I find kind of funny. You know, it's like, yeah, we've been here before. Didn't stay, but, you know, we have been. It it's like, it's weird directly going down, you know? Anyway, bump, and, okay, cool of them to actually have it so that those guys get destroyed in one shot. Uh, instead of needing to, like, spam fire them, you can charge in and be prepared. And here this is. Right, now, this is weird as everything. So, I'm going to try and make my best sense of it. So, I believe if we spam fire this... I think, I think we can ride this really far into the stage, which is great, because I want to. I'm also, I need to for an upgrade. Oh, well, that works. Um, so, oh, can I take your bike off you, actually? No, I don't, I don't think I can. That's unfortunate, because I believe if we ride the bike the whole way here, um, we get ourselves a cheeky will. Not that, uh, but we can, if we keep riding it and we jump over that um, desert tornado creator thing, Okay, the checkpoint's here, which is cool enough. Even though it's a bit early in the stage, I'll take it. But, um, if we keep riding it, there's a set of spikes we can ride on that will give us a piece of heart. And I would like to pick it up here. Oh, come on. I hate... It, it. It's like the most fragile damn thing on planet Earth. Anyway, if we keep this charged, it, it, those, those guys just... Oh, and that was a mine. Okay. I thought it was a pickup, but I should have known better. Yeah, those bikes die at, like, the slightest show of inconvenience, which is kind of unfortunate. So it's like, I'm vibing with them, but yeah, no, it's... Can I get back and see if the bike's respawned? Oh, it has. Oh, okay. And then we just need to keep it going. No, okay, seriously. I think we've got this. As annoying as it may be for us to continuously have to attempt this, I think we might have this. I'm just going to very quickly, when we get up here, make sure to go back and take that guy out. Now, with him dealt with... It's just a matter of, like, spam fire and jump at the right moment, is it not? Okay. Well, I don't think there's any going back from that, but... Is that... Oh, there is! Okay. Sorry, this is like an addiction almost, but if we jump on that very last one... Keep spam firing with him as usual. I think we have this, because this was the one piece of heart in Little Guide I viewed... That was like... I don't say impossible, but it seemed, it seemed like it was going to be the most nightmarish to get, you know? Anyway, so we do this, we just need to look out for the... Nope, do not shoot me! Okay, yeah, clearly clearly, I need better timing with that. Um, or, better yet, I can just go without the two extra pieces of things, but it's that there, and then you jump and get up onto that top part there, I believe. Or you bring it in here and jump. It's, um... I'm trying to think where it is. It's somewhere in here. Um, what does this do, actually? Can I... Is there anything I have that particularly would create a platform? I don't think so kind of unfortunate <laughs> and we're on one health so yeah but no it's, it's it's literally directly up there as you can see what okay i'm sorry those go quick and you can barely jump them but that's where i want to be um okay i'm just gonna retake that So this is a retake of this stage, because I got my hands under to me, admittedly. Going into overdrive off stretcher stages, final, final attempt. Well, not final attempt, final boss, even, uh, before the finale. Which, honestly, maybe may be able to cram into this episode, depending on how long we run for. It's only been 10 minutes since the recording started, so it's feasible. 
That said, I should probably explain... Um, what, what, what was, well, I was gonna say something. I was probably explain how I'm uh, planning to make this work. Also, wow, I hate, I hate these things so much! Oh, thank you for the extra health, I need it after that. Like, those things I do not like, they're an Omagusta in, in the Neramic Empire. Uh, is he gonna- okay, he's not gonna camp the bottom of my ladder like his equivalent in X1 did. Uh, but in the stage there is a um, heart piece, which is very obviously visible. But getting it is a nightmare, so it's um, it's one of those where it's like, yeah. But basically, um, to my knowledge, we need to destroy as much of this as we can, and then I believe crash into that, which destroys our bike. But if we were to go back a few seconds, would you look at that? There's a new bike. But there's now a guy chasing us on a bike, which isn't the best, admittedly. But what we can, that was really stupid. Basically, we need to knock that ramp down and boost. And I believe, with good enough timing, we basically get onto the next platform. Now, it may take a few attempts, but basically the idea is, um, cross that massive gap with our bike while boosting. You know, cool. <laughs> uh, kill the problem before it exists. Uh, but, I want the can I? That needed shooting down. Basically, that's the thing. Um, I think, I'm not sure if I showed this off in a previous episode or not, but that's generally the idea. Now that's shot down, I think if we boost the whole way and just spam fire, we may actually be good, which is a nice welcome thing. Also, that doing that, funny. Um, so I believe we've got this, and then, um, I think, uh, one more? No! As if! That's stupid, I'm sorry. I, I at least expected that to somewhat work, but fine. I will fight him without the extra two pieces. If needs be, um, okay, I don't like this. For, um, okay, unfortunately. Okay, so we can just camp here, actually. Never mind. <laughs> it works out. Bump, and come on. I hate these enemies, man. They, they take forever to defeat, and then, like, they spawn another one down here. It's like, are you serious? Yeah, but that's where the piece of heart is. It's like, I wish there was a boomerang item, but we don't seem to have it. Unless, I don't know, maybe... No, we don't have the arm parts, either. Curses. Um, so I was thinking maybe we could charge up and make it work. Um, what about... There's got to be something in here, right? Surely. Oh, there is. Hey! Okay. White. Mega Man X, enter the capsule. This enhancement will modify your main drive units. Huh? With it, you will be able to dash while in midair. Use it wisely, Mega Man X. Well, excuse me for accidentally getting a body up. Oh! Can we... Wait, did, did I, did I, did I, wait, did I need to step into this, don't I? Yeah, okay, I did not actually get the leg upgrade, I am dumb. But, yeah, okay, thank you, White. So if I jump into this, are you guys thinking what I'm thinking? So we got the legs, cool. I wonder, can I? That's like, that is a long jump. That is a long jump calling my name. We dash and jump regularly, then we dash and jump again, and depending on where we land, funny things happen. Oh, this could be, if that is if that is the solution to the answer on our journey, I will take it. Need to get slightly better, that's it. This is all experimenting here. But we got the leg parts, so we can't complain if we're not getting an armor upgrade. We got the leg parts, <laughs> even though they may be the weaker one, I don't know. So, so if I were to... That's, that doesn't bode well for me, actually. Or does it? Yeah, no, so if I dash jump, I can't... Okay, seriously, I'm just gonna spam kill... Actually, no, I probably shouldn't, because I'm gonna try and get in there again. Um, I don't know. Actually, so does this connect to walls, like I've been told? It does, okay. What if... And this is like an, such an oddly specific thing. What if we dash jump and then shoot that? Not a chance. Although that thing dropping out the ceiling, it's, it's tempting me, but I am going to take the chance to save. Um, I'll meet you guys back there, and we'll continue on with the rest of the level, and we'll just... We'll see how we can 
beat the level, and then we'll come back to that if needs be. Oi, okay. So that is a very effective way to take them out using the Soul Blade. I'm gonna duly note that for later. Now, with that said, I think we are coming up on the boss room, if I remember correctly. So, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, seriously, I did not anticipate this to be my, like, savior from these guys I hate, but it kills them. So, I'm um, looking on the sub-tank, we have very little in the sub-tank, and I'm um, Crystal Thing. Yeah, so I was right. It may be, are these levels getting shorter, or am I just getting better so they feel shorter? I don't know. E, the way, okay, right. Uh, I, am I meant to climb up here? Not really, um, oh. Okay, why am I, am I trying to light the rocket on fire? I, I think I did. Oh, it swapped me back to my X Buster for that as well, so it didn't use any actual ammo. Intriguing. And come on, I would really like, I'm um, kind of actually, yeah, I would like to work on Crystal H. Okay, so I think I've got a rough idea for how you work. We're just gonna hope and pray here. So, your first move, I get, no, okay, so hit you when you're running, I'm right, then. So that works, and then. Oh, so I can hit him in the air. Beautiful. Okay, okay, I think I've got a strat here. I just did it on a pure whim because I thought, that's awfully, like, low to the ground. And oh, what awfully low to the ground it is for him. <laughs> okay, and then jump again. Oh, this is literally a stunlock. I know, it's been a while since we stunlocked someone, hasn't it? <laughs> Bam, and then... Oh, yes, okay, barely connecting. And then one more, one more time. Come on. Okay, and there we go. I hate the fact they got that strategy down so well. Also, I found out what we need to do to get that piece of heart. We need the arm parts. Um, we need to charge them up with the flame thing, and that shoots us forward. It is how it is. Anyway, he's dead, so, um... Speaking on the arm parts, I should probably go get them, shouldn't I? Um, I think I might capture myself getting the, um, the arm parts and the head parts, but I don't think I'll capture myself getting the, like, sub-tanks and hearts, just because that'll take way up too much time. And we can power through it as quick as we can. But here we are. Hello, old man, once again. Mega Man X, I've located the X Hunter's base. It's at grid location. Ooh, that's right at the North Pole. Roger, Dr. Kane, I'm on my way. It will take some more time to reactivate Zero. Slow them down, the Mega Man X. Um, us reactivate Zero or them reactivate Zero, because. We have Zero's body, we can just kind of like, you know, like, clock him in. But, ooh, an ominous. Hello, hello. Well, I'm gonna cut to me getting the other armor parts, and then I'll come back once I'm completely stacked out with everything else the game has left to offer. <gasps> Yo! My love. I probably have to remove this, but hell yeah. Okay, so that's the arm upgrade. Mwah. How the hell are people meant to find this? Look. Well, um, anyway, that's that's the upgrades done. Sorry if the background music sounds weird. I'm definitely listening to the Kevin soundtracks and not the Sugar Babes right now. It took about like 30 minutes, but we've got all the upgrades bar the helmet one, which kind of didn't help. It helps you find the upgrades, but as I had a guide, I figured I'd skip it. Now that said, excellent stage. I believe there are five of these according to the guide I'm on, so we will just have to adapt, improvise, and overcome. So, uh, let's get down to business then. Uh, first of all, greeted by bats. Can't say I'm a particularly surprised, but you know, it is how it is. Uh, we just need to be very, very careful on where we fall, because anything can be a, um, a what's it called? A kill. Um, although those are, those are like some cheap shots, but yeah, it feels quite good to basically have maxed out health now, I'll admit. Because it's like, well, yeah, you know, what's it, what's it gonna do? What, what can it do to kind of, you know, knock that much health off me? I don't know. But, okay, that guy got away with a little bit of cheap, cheap health there, but it does feel cool to power up for the final stage. I, I, I'm sure some people would rather me do it earlier in the series and get myself an easier time, but I kind of like doing it just for the final stage. Maybe that's just me being weird, but, nah. Either way, uh, I gotta really... Okay, okay, this is... That's just foul. Okay, but it is how it is. It gets away again, uh, basically scot-free. And, nope, we, we have a thing for this. There, perish. <laughs> it's, it's so cheap, but I love it. 
And oh, another time? Another a chance to use like this is quickly turning into my new favorite weapon because it takes care of those guys easily. Anyway, what we got here? Just a simple uh, wall climb? Huh. Well, that was actually surprisingly easy. Can I? Oh, and I can take him out for some free health? Do not mind if I do. Also, we don't need to worry about anything extra in this stage, I'm pretty sure. Just literally. Can I? You feel mur- Yeah, you feel murdery. You're gonna- Okay, yeah, okay. I had a fear that happened, but- Oh, nope. Was it worth using? Probably not. But okay, so we gotta fight back against those a tad bit. Nothing too difficult though. Nope, okay. I'm not, I'm not gonna have to do the thing. I'm not gonna get into the cycle of infinitely respawning things. Nah, 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 nah. That ain't, that ain't my forte. So is that, this seems to be the way down. Oh no, oh. Huh. Well, um, right, that screams to me, boss incoming. I'm not sure about anyone else. Anyway, if we stand here, can I? I can absolutely do that and take them both out. Okay. <laughs> Look at me and my infinite wisdom. Damn it. Curse my infinite wisdom. It seems to be flawed in certain aspects. Bonk. And okay. Did I take out the other one? Nah, I didn't. He's still running. He still lives. And that's unacceptable. Anyway, so I assume this is on the way to the end now. Ha, huh, we've already been here, haven't we? Yeah, we have. So they're trying to toss me back down there, okay. Got you. So we need to not fall down. Got it. So I wonder if, is, is that the right way then? No, that's just the ceiling. Um, so that's, is it this way? It might be this way. It is this way, okay. You see, I see an enemy with hostile intent and I think, ah, the correct way. No, son of a bitch. That was tight, that, but well, hopefully we got a, uh, a thing. Um, okay, I think I recognize where this is. Yep, okay, it's, it's Arm Man. Ooh, okay, well, if we can just do that to evade them, I won't complain. <laughs> okay, nah, it's not, it wasn't gonna be that easy, but at least they don't take health while they, you know, try and cook your attempts. You know, it's like, you know, they're always polite like that. <laughs> I, I say polite, it's, make, it's make, make them an enemy. They're still public enemy number one in my eyes, but it, it's the thought that counts, ish. Anyway, so it's up this way. So I wonder why the hell there's that then, but, yeah. And though it's, it is this one, okay. Just gotta make sure to remember to jump and switch and then do a bit of that. And yeah, of course he gets his free hit. But we have our charge to Oh, well that's that that seems a bit stupid now, doesn't it? Uh and there is the first boss door. Okay. Um just so we know, our sub tanks are charging a decent bit. And now that's that I am actually very quickly. I know this is probably gonna be a bit distraught. We're just gonna drag this over here. And it is bubble splash. Got you. I I was not reading anything. No, I just it came to me in a dream that he may or may not be weak to the bubble splash. Yeah. Oh, it's you. Okay. Well, I'm down for this. So is this the same strat as last time, where it's just stand in front of you and pray that you don't try and kill me? Because if so, this becomes a really this is basically just a formality at this point, you know. I see that Richard Shane back towards me. I don't think so. Oh, they do that many, okay. Okay, so I'm gonna get my timing a bit better here, but I think I think the general like notion of how to fight him still sounds, I think. Okay, and then fight. Oh. Okay, so he, when he gets angry, he gets angry. No issue for us though. Again, our sub tank's gonna make this more than easy. What? How could he have overloaded my circuitry? Ah. Dramatic, I know. And is that him dead? Is that the first stage really done? Just so, I'll take it. I'll put my hands up and go like, mm. no, it's out, it's out my hands. If that's the stage, that's the stage. Mm. Oh, it is. Cool. <laughs> also, we take less damage because of one of the upgrades. The other one lets us charge our arms and of course we picked up like upgrade on camera. Well, I'll save that happily. So stage two is Sergius, so I am told. Apparently, this is a a, a bit a bit evil, but we will uh, we'll find a way to make it work. So in we go again. Let's crack the stage then. Okay, all right, ready and under the water. Good job, we're a robot. Nope. Okay, I was I was gonna say I would be very surprised if these fish weren't used in this stage on pure account of we've seen them used in one actual stage. You know. <laughs> It's like, something tells me they probably want to get their mileage out of them. That said, these guys are really annoying to deal with. Um, maybe that's just me running to a minor inconvenience and disliking something, as it oftentimes will be. But, okay, and then, oh, okay, so you guys, you, you try and be difficult with me. Damn it, I, I don't like it when things get, okay, you are not, you are not, you are not nice. Okay, can I? I mean, it works, it's just really scuffed. 
Um, oh, and these guys. They're really bringing out the all-star cast for this stage, ain't they? Either way, if I can just keep my shit charged, keep my health on high enough, I think we should be Gucci. I say, we get, we get hit by, like, every little thing, but... General idea seems to still be pretty, pretty sore. No, please! I, I don't like these damn things. Oh, okay, I was, I was gonna say, can I just ride this the whole way there? No, I can't. Although, if that guy spawned in, that's gonna cause me a bit of issues. Damn it! Tweet me be! <laughs> okay, and there we go. And then onto this. Oh, I don't like that. Oh. Okay, well, okay, well, when I can leave, of course. Eh? Oh, I see. Not sure how I'm Augusta that. Probably not at all. Um, so we just gotta spam this, be very careful. And then, eh? What the fuck is that? Eh? Oh. Oh. Right, well, yeah, I'll, I'll save that. Um. Okay. I see those spikes and I sweat slightly, but it's fine. It's fine. New set of lives. We can do this. Again, there's three stages, I believe, and then there's a fourth one, and then a blur. Okay, so we got a bit of a hefty content uh, mine to get through here. Okay, sorry. Who gave you permission to injure me? Oh, they die in one hit. Okay, now now these are my types of enemies. Like, they're annoying, but at least they die quick. <laughs> um, kind of like bats, except, you know, the bats, we have, like, a, a symbiotic relationship now, you could say. Um, either way, just got to keep dodging this as best I can. And there we go. Unload onto this poor little man. And Oh, yeah, no, I forget he does that. Super annoying, isn't it? No! You will die! By my hand! Nope, give me that! Or not. Okay, fine, well, we'll show here! I knew- I called it- I called it on the last attempt! No! That feels like bullshit. Why is that segment there? Like, it's just- it- it- it feels like that exists purely to waste my time. Which I'm not happy about. So, again, at least these fish- Main, 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 main positive with them is that at least they die fast, which is like, is that really positive? <laughs> it's like, yes, I'm happy that your death is something I can look forward to. Um, anyway, bump you again. These guys, like, there must be an easier way to deal with these guys, right? Sure. I don't know. That might be. If it is, if it exists, I don't know what it is. Anyway, let's uh, do a bit of this again. We're gonna just take this guy out without the hassle this time, and I think. Yeah, so we can either, like, go around this the peaceful way or the, the Noramic way. So, of course, we're going to take the Noramic way, because it's funny. And I, that stray shot, man. What the fuck? Okay, I'm, I'm dash jumping, but apparently the game just doesn't want to acknowledge the jump. Like, do those missile things just have the biggest, like, what would it be? Hitbox in existence? I don't know, but I'm not happy. Nope. Okay, like, surely I could maybe, maybe I can just dash this section. I mean, that would work, but like, you know, it's like, yeah, I take damage, but, like, I get the goddamn checkpoint quicker. <laughs> yeah, no, that... Okay. To be fair, we took significantly less damage there than what I think anyone was anticipating. And then do that again. Of course, gonna get the 1-2 special on the go, and... I wonder, can I just... Okay, so I can do that. Okay, so it works here, it's just on this one platform specifically, it decides... No. No, that... Yeah, yeah, see, that's what I mean, it was capping me there, but... Here, fine, I can jump across, like, perfectly. How oddly bizarre. Either way, um, we know we know the deal here, so we just gotta... I love precision platforming in Mega Man. It's my favorite aspect of the franchise. Mmm. Gimme more, as Britney Spears would say. Yeah, because we've got to bring her into this recording. No, I... What the fuck? Am I meant to... Was I meant to have a sixth sense and know they were coming, or what? Don't you... I know what you are. This is... Is this another one? No. Wait, is it not? I... This isn't solid ground. I'm not an idiot. But how in the hell do I cross this? You. Wait, what? Can I encase myself in crystal and walk... Ah, yeah. Alright, well, that's slow. That gives me slow motion, but that's not. I'm gonna. You son of a gun. 
Okay, single-handedly, that guy just saved me. Oh. Okay. Sorry, that, that's the only response to give to a section like that. Actually suck your mum. Sorry if I seem angry today. It's a very angry day today, as I'm sure you can guess. Like, I can only play this game for so long before I start to bold. Charge up flame dash and jump. That, that literally may make the most, most sense, as annoying as it is. Okay, that works. That barely works as an idea, but it worked nonetheless. Now that looks like something I can use this on. So can I? I can do that. Okay, delicious. I'll take that. Don't know what's this way, though. Do I want to know what's that way? Not really. And here we go. No, that's not... Oh, apparently Morph Morph just kills that guy instantly. Cool. Anyway, here we go. So, um, we're going to do a death run attempt this time, because I don't think... Okay, I suppose I've got nothing in. Um, we need to figure out how to crack this guy. So, destroy... Okay, again, I've got the guide up here, because I don't particularly have the most time in the world here. So, now everything makes a bit more sense. Oh, no! I do not like that. No! Okay, can I... So, so these all take damage. Well, they all, they all try to. Um, so, so, how much damage do each of these do? This is just review. So, that does one. And also getting hit by his jelly bean fun time. Okay, got you. So I assume fully charging my X bust is probably a good way to remove those. But luckily we have a guide. One silk shot should take out a single turret. Silk shot, it's the hardest like word to say. But we just conveniently select that for no given reason. And then apparently we use the slicer to finish him off, so. Yeah. Um, let's do this then. Just gotta pray that these will do it. Which I have no doubt they will. So. Oh wow, that really did. Oh no! Oh no! My sweet honey! Alabama! Like, I'm literally going off screen here. Huh? Okay, no, can I get the speed slicer, please? Thank you. No! I'm sorry, I got hit while charging that and that cancelled it as if. Eh? Okay, sorry, sorry. I was told, I was told just charge it here. It's a size six seconds reach full speed and surge is always moving around. Go be swift what it is. Jump down to the exposed piece of the machine where the turret wall used to be. Standing here will give you a better chance of avoiding his attacks and land more effective hits. Well then, that charge up and unleash the blade rain on him. They do more damage than single shots of the slicer. Apparently I've just been doing single rain. I... Not sure I entirely understand. This is the Sonic Slicer. I... I don't... Am I having a stroke? I... Right. Good way to avoid damage, arguably. Hit the X Hunter is to jump down onto the exposed piece of the machine, where we are. Um, something he'll give you a chance of avoiding his attacks and more effective hits. While down there, charge up the Sonic Slicer and unleash the Blade Rain on him. They always do more damage than single shots of the Slicer. If you stand in the right spot, you'll almost always land the hit. <laughs> What part of that? Like, like, admittedly, Morph Moth thing being one hit kill. Gucci. The slicer, though. Like, okay, we've sliced through a tiny bit of our reserves, but fortunately, Morph Moth can crack again. Just, oh man, I. I don't like it. Let's get this done as best we can, though. Like, fortunately, this takes, like, single hits. It's just. Hitting him with this slicer? Mmm. So. Nope. I don't know how that works, but it did. And then you, okay, die. Then slicer time, slicey time. Oh, I see what people mean now, okay. So, I charged this up and then I need to, uh... so yeah. I kind of see what they mean, or at least what they were going for. The issue is, is I just, I'm charging this up, but I don't understand where they're going. Like, it's a boomerang, admittedly, so. Again, stand on the exposed part of the machine, where the turret wall used to be. Standing gives you a better chance of avoiding his attacks and one more effective hits. Then just unleash the blade rain on him, that's it. Like, is this, is this the most effective area? I, oh, 
Of course. I'm well acquainted with with that. Okay. Why is it suddenly going upwards now? I. The issue is, as I'm slightly concerned that this won't actually um, this won't last. Unfortunately, it's like we've got this charge, and then we need to fight him in a different manner, which is like, meh. Like, I wonder, can I can I mess him up? Let me mess him up. Okay, maybe that's not the uh, the right way. Maybe. Okay, apologies. Um, okay, that's not particularly building all that well. Um, I'm gonna pop as uh, I'm gonna pop sword tank. Okay, what else can I attack him with? Um, magnet mine, magnet mine. That might work. Now I just gotta hit him again, one more time, for the homie DJ screw, and he's dead. Okay, surges. This is impossible. The prophecy must be fulfilled. The only prophecy being fulfilled here is me leaving this damn stage. It's over. It's over. It's over. That's what matters. That's what counts. I've got 20 minutes left to finish the whole game. Something's going to tell me a big old no there. Oh, man. I... It, it, that was exhausting. Well, he's dead. He's dead. And if needs be, I could return at a later time. Okay, we're going again. Um, it's about three hours later, and I had to go out for lunch. So it's, uh, well, time has passed, shall we say. So, um, I may be a bit in inexperienced again, but that's fine. We'll, uh, we'll live and we'll learn. Yeah, so, yeah, we have all our upgrades and stuff. Again, it's, uh, it's been a hot minute, so do bear with me if I'm uh, not entirely up to code, but we'll, uh, we'll make it work. So I think we can just stay under this guy and then... Yeah, that second shot is devastating, so I think I definitely would like to uh, maintain uh, that as a... In there. Okay, up there's the place where... Nope, can I... Ah, damn it. I, I remember they gave me uh, good stuff last time, but apparently it was not always meant to be, sadly. Gotta say, though, we do look relatively... Dri it's this. That was it. No, we managed to get this up, didn't we, in the end? So we figured out, like, the basics, I believe. And then we can go the rest of the way. It's um, one of those later on, though, that I think gave us issue, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, we, yeah, we have those to probably charge a sub-tank with, but I just... Pardon me saying no. Anyway, so we do that, that, then that, and then when it winds up, do that. And we shouldn't clip anything. So then we go this way, that way, and then it's very quick, but it's that, followed by that. That didn't work. So we go again. No, seriously? Okay. No, you are right. You, you can go. You can go. And then we gotta barely clip it like so, then. Okay, seriously, we will get this. It's just a right pain to do. And this is mainly why. Somehow that worked. Okay, so we do this, that, followed by that, followed by this, then that, then that, then this, I think? Okay, that, that works. That works as a, as a basic idea, it functions. And then I think... Okay, somehow this is working. And then we go up some more. Okay, we can make this work. It's just a very... It's when it goes down. Oh, no! Oh, can we actually get in there? We, we might be able to. Um, let's just... Um, we should be able to get up there, surely. Uh, maybe... Hmm... Oh, there is it. Okay, is that if it's solid, maybe there's a bit more here. No. So that's us done then. Which is really annoying, I must say. This whole section is just a right pain to deal with. Plus, the spikes in the bottom kind of don't add particularly much. I just, I wish there was a better way to do this section. Uh, but it seems like this is just kind of the pattern we'll have to fall into. Um, I just pray that we're able to get through this with all our lives, because I think going about this without being maxed out on lives. Smart idea. Okay, that's some way to get up, I suppose. Um, oh my word, that took a while. Um, seriously, that took so long. What I think is this, uh, one of these ways must be the correct way, one of these ways must be the wrong way. Um, how the hell will I get up there? I, su I suppose big floaty platforms, probably it. Anyway, can I, if I blitz you out, can we, um, can we just move on with our lives now? Please, because, oh my god, that sucks! No! That should be criminal. That should be criminal, killing you there. I feel, okay, thank god it posted me back in. If it, if it did not, I would have been slightly annoyed. 
So, oh, okay, so two of those does work out then. I'm just gonna make sure to uh, carefully, and I do, I do say this very, um, very like, I'm not sure what to call it, cursorily, um, very, very, very just with cause. Um, bloody dying uh, is not on my agenda here. Um, can I get like something, something good? There we are. That, 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 that's, that's been the premise of something good, I suppose. Now, what's going on here? Because something's screaming at me saying, this is far from being the end. Um, okay, well, we got that, but what? Ah, yeah. Not a chance. Alright, well, at least we can see the four. And it's literally, I think it is... It, oh, okay, I forget, I forget that that's a thing that it does. Okay, well, thank you for getting stuck in the wall there, uh, Power Up. Appreciate you. Um... Again, any sub tank stuff I can get on the go would be great. Um, I don't actually know what is the. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm gonna have to pause for a sec. Agile flyer. Um, what is this? Okay, I, if I walk on spikes there, you all have like a perfect right to bully me forever. Um, no, oi! Let me kill you. So is this. This must be a dash jump section, but I'm really paranoid about it, evidently. Um,. So we're just gonna make sure we don't mess this up, and it would be. Oh, you! F Who designed that? You can't see where you're meant to be jumping to. Da -da -da -da. I, I, this this music is starting to feel more like an insult than anything else. Anytime I hear it. Oh my god! I do not like that. I. No. Okay, that was hell. That was hell. Oh, uh, I hurt my fingers. I don't know how many lives I'm left on. One. Fun. Okay, so what do we do here then? Apparently the best way to defeat this guy is with the charged up magnetic mine. So we're going to do that and pray we got enough. I'm going to actually try and take him decently serious. We here because we do have the sub tanks to try and make it work. But what the fuck? Okay. Um, so what is your dealio here? Okay, so that... Oh, it's like Jenga-ish. So that... So that does deal damage. Oh, that deals a lot of damage, actually. Okay, I get the gist here. Or I get the vibe at the minimum. What the hell? Okay, so he completely just sapped my ability to do anything there, but that... That does move through and make a decent bit of, um... Ah, of course! How did I not see that coming? How foolish of me to not foresee the part where I get trapped under spikes. Ah, rookie mistake, I guess. Gah. What, whatever was I thinking? How dare I? Okay, so, literally just charge up magnetic mine, fire at him, and it will mess him up. Which is like, I mean, it is how it is. Kind of partly wishing that it would um, have a bit more um, d description than that, but it is how it is. Oh, and I can't do it while it's charged. Got you. Well, this time we got to go all out on the on the everything, really. So again, I don't particularly understand what goes on here. Um, I suppose now's a good time to try and use as much of one sub tank as I can, but I don't particularly clock what happens here. Like, yes, that does two damage, and then these happen, and then throw this. That should. Okay, that that does damage him. Okay, and then, I suppose those, like, things are trying to get me off the wall then, perhaps? I don't know. Alright, either way, we can start charging again. Um, we've got more health than he does left, but then again, we have used the sub-tank. We just gotta get that in him, and that should... Then, come on, if I can just wait for this to start charging again, I think this might be the one. Please, please connect, please connect. It does not connect. Fun. This is bad. This is very bad, actually. Um, okay, we need to we need to sub tank because otherwise, I mean, what's the point? Um, I suppose burner will have to do. No, that's oh, that, that's annoying. And um, what can we use? What can we use? A crystal thing. Nah, it's, it's gonna have to be expert, isn't it? Okay, this hurts. It significantly hurts me to have to do. 
Oh! Okay, so that second shot was all we needed. No, this cannot be, Master. Avenge me! Wrecked. Absolutely wrecked. Definitely did not come down to the wire at all. Stop looking at that. Absolutely did not go down to the wire at all. So we are understood with each other. I'm not sweating, you are. Okay, don't understand the logistics of that fight, but we can now save peace and love. Okay, so that leaves two stages left, and I believe this next one is meant to be a boss rush. So, let's do it. You know, it's like we can stomach it. Um, I don't fully understand how exactly um, health is gonna work on here, whether there's a way to replenish health or what, but apparently we've got to fight a lot of these guys back to back. Can we not? We got that, which maybe, I don't know, maybe that's, uh, we'll see. Um, well, we jump in here. I assume the final stage is just the final boss, is it not? So, now, let's, uh, let's see, how do I, so we got all these guys up here, and oh, so there, there is stuff dotted around here for health, if needs be. Well, I suppose we'll head onto this far left one, far right one. I know my directions, and see who you is. You, well, we already know that your thing was the magnetic mine, was it not? So, gonna get that selected. Starting off as, I think, the more familiar things we should do first, because that does allow us to preserve a good amount of health. Oh, I do like the setup for this stage, though. I think it is intriguing. So, you're gonna do this, and then slam into the wall, like some sort of dunce. And then, okay, so yeah, you got, oh, you're spinning, like, rapidly. And then, oh, okay, so when he does his charge attack, that's... So, also, I've, okay, never mind, I have that entirely wrong. Oh, okay, yeah, well, apology. Ew, oh, you rat. Okay, make a brief jump cut there. Um, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Uh, interesting, that, actually. Oh, I wonder, can I? Can I okay, no, never mind. I was, I had, I had a plan, and the plan was very flawed. So, I wonder, how do I know which way he, because sometimes he makes it go slow-mo, and then other times he charges. I wonder if there's a way to tell that. Either way, so he's gonna go spin now, and I would love for him to, oh, he does do his charge, okay, well. Again, this is real, this is like a reliable strategy because he just likes to injure himself more than anything. So again, if maybe if I go directly underneath them, maybe maybe he feels threatened. I don't know. I mean, that does seem to be the working theory at the very least. Then slam him into there, which we just got one more thing left. And as they all have a unique weakness, it is how it is. And then yes, we do, he does his little fizz out thing, and that's that. Not super proud about the health we lost there, but it's nothing completely irrecoverable, you know. Fair enough. So that's one down, seven more to go. Unfortunately. So that teleports us out and breaks the teleporter, doesn't it? Yes. Well, I may as well get into this one then. I may as well try and beat this guy with what we've got. And it is you. You had a thing, didn't you? It was Morph Moths, I believe. Silk Shot. So, let's see if we can get this right. And then he's going to teleport. And then we need to hit him while he teleports. Yeah, I recall this. He's really easy to stunlock, this guy. So very, very good of us to um, take him on first. So he's gonna do his little shuriken attack, right? And then we can, uh, we can go hit him like that. So yeah, if we, if we can get him on the ground, it's basically just a free shot, which I love. It's like, <laughs> um, yeah. Okay. So I don't think, he, like, I'm not gonna jinx it by saying, oh, he's yet to hit us yet, because you know, there's always, always one person who's like, I, I don't, I don't, I don't want to make myself, you know, I don't, I don't want to give any people a funny moment of me sounding like a right old hypocrite. Yeah, you got plenty of other videos for that, not this one. Anyway, on the floor, free hit. Like, if he hits on the floor, it is just... Like, <laughs> it may seem like a joke, but no, like, he, genuinely, the wall climbing is the only thing that really gives him a bit of an edge. And he went, he had an option to go on the ceiling and potentially hit me. And then left. Like, okay, so we can jump on the ceiling, I'll give him that much, but... Beyond that, this is just a bit of an embarrassing... Ooh! Well done on the fa The fake out, but... Can't fake me out. Okay, and you... Mate, you came back. Okay. Say no more. Done. Two out of eight completed. I just wonder, I hope that the final boss isn't after this boss rush. I hope not. But that's that guy done, and we can also cross stuff off mentally in our head, you know, if we have, haven't done it. So, and that's that done. Um, this was the one that I tried in my little demo. I say demo run. The one, that, the, the run I lost, um, like 30 seconds before starting this one. Um, so can I? I must be able to get up here, right? I can. Yes. Yeah. So um, we'll get these little uh, little pellets here because I think, honestly, they're complimentary. We may as well make uh, the most of them. It's like it is how it is. And I wonder what this guy in the top top is. Let's see what's going on with him. Um, and your morph morph. Okay. 
phenomenal, actually. Again, we got right. We can't waste a second. We need to immediately equip that burner and go. Again, this guy was this guy was mainly just the war of attrition previously, if I recall. So, oh, okay, yep. Yeah, so you're gonna. Okay, it means to dig through that. Come on. Okay, I recall. I remember. What the hell is that? What? What in the heel? Okay. Okay. Yeah. Definitely. Um, taking a bit more of a beating than I would have liked. Could possibly come through though. Again, it's just th th this trash bit. I. I don't know. So he's going to ascend now, and he goes into his little fabulous form, as we'll call it. So. This was- this is all our remaining health, mind you, so it's like, meh. Yeah, so it's all Stardust, um, Stardust Act. Not my fave thing in the world. But it's not- it's not unbeatable. Like, that, that's three out of eight. Like, I think coming in here with sub-tanks is definitely wise? But best comes to best, those free energy pellets recover after each fight. Or after a certain milestone is met. And I think that's, um... Probably the best shot we've got at uh, beating this, honestly. Relying on freebies. Which, fortunately for us, we have got a few more. It, it's very small amounts, but it is how it is. Um, so we do get these back then. Um, which is basically, that's an indicator of how much health we can afford to lose per fight. Which is, to say, not a lot. Either way, we can cross a uh, flame bird off. Wheel Gator, okay, you had the special thing of the strike chain, if I recall correctly. So this should be very interesting. You were already easy enough to beat. So he's gonna um, send wheels out, isn't he? Yeah, I, re I remember this. No, okay. We go, we go, okay. Bump. Don't lose health, don't lose health. Oh, okay, you get... Then this, and then... Oh, he goes back under, okay. See, we can... I think we can get this. It's not, it's not outside the realm of possibility, you know? Okay, and bam. Hit you, and then it goes back under. Okay, he's definitely playing the coward's game here. And then we just need to keep at this. Um, we can't really stay in one place for too long, because if we do, he gets us! Again, N64 my hand. Okay, got it. And then please just pop up in a place. Yeah, so he pops up in a place that's almost like guaranteed. But he wo he's loving his ocean attacks today, unfortunately. And then we just gotta keep doing this. Keep doing this. No! Okay, seriously, he's really starting to bother me there. Uh, again, thankfully this armor does reduce the health damage we take, but... So yes, yeah, so he does... Oi, okay, that, that's just me being dumb. Okay. And then, I just gotta really keep... Okay, bam, we actually dodged him this time. But seriously, he keeps going under. The second he fires a cog, um, or does his cog attack, it were basically chilling. But we're not, because he wants to be funny like that. Oh, there we go, okay. Now, please, just go into his... He, he's, he's gonna be persistent on this, isn't he? Like, it's, it's good for him, don't get me wrong, it's very good for him if he's able to, you know, keep with this. But, in terms of me, no it's not. Again, this is getting stupid now. Maybe it's because I'm using the strike chain on him, I don't know. Again, if, I just, if I'm just if i dashing away, I think I might get him. Okay, that was technically dodgeable. Obviously not, wasn't, but you know. Now we just gotta stay here, bop you. And then he, he's always, always gonna go back under if we use the strike chain on him, isn't he? Then dodge that, stand here, and then start doing these. Bam, okay. Please just stay, just stay. This is so awful. It's just, it just, it basically is just a glorified waste of time. <laughs> okay, really? Okay, one final like bit to spite me, come on. And then come on, he's gonna do his uh, fake jump and back, nope. You are not crocodile rolling me. Nah, -uh, I know how much damage that does. So, yeah, if we collect the health after each boss, I think we... If we... We'll be, like, on a controlled descent of health, almost. Um... So that does make... Um... Okay, no, make... Thankfully didn't, um, accidentally step in there. Yeah, we are... We, we, we're still alive for now. Uh, but yeah, no, I think... Like, how much do we get for this? Because this... Obviously... The, the, the upgrade we got was the, um... I'm trying to think. Uh, my brain's gone, like, dead. Okay, so we've got everything up here. And the upgrade we've got reduced our damage by the damage taken by us by half. So, theoretically, we have what would be considered a full thing. And oh, it's this guy, but now he's at night time. What was he weak to? Not Magnet Mine. It wasn't Speed Slicer. He gives us Speed Slicer. Um, Crystal, that was it. Yep. 
Okay, this was the guy that we could just cook, basically. Which I'm down to do. Um, again, I forgot we fi we, we did technically wish you fight in this episode, so it's like, it is how it is. Okay, so if we just keep at that. So if he jumps up, can, we, can I like... Okay, no, wrong button. Okay, that, that still worked, even though I hit the wrong thing. So like, I think I've got... I think I can get it down to a bit of a science here. <laughs> um... I mean, unfortunately for him, I think I, I think we got it down, like, once we're on a slope, it's like, I think it's over. <laughs> Which is great, because if we leave this with a positive um, net gain. And look, look at me, I'm using my business terms to describe a Mega Man Let's Play. Come on, please, just charge after me. Come on, do the charge. You know you want to do the charge. Oh, that also works. Okay, and we bump up a tiny bit more. Not awful. That's six or five. One of the two. Either way, we're making okay progress. Like, it's all stuff we fought before. It's just now, obviously, a bit more intensive. Well, this does make process of elimination ten times easier. Um, we just gotta find a way to get up here. And um, once I can get up there... Okay, uh, jump here, then here. Oh, excuse my ignorance. Um, yes, we got... Like, what, what are we left to use now, then? Um, so we get to use the... I'm trying to think. Um... Yet use the speed slicer, which I think. Who do we use the speed slicer on? Would that have been wheel guy? No, it wouldn't be wheel guy. It would have been weather control guy. So I think weather control guy. The one I don't recognise is probably speed slicer. And then bubble crab wheel, and then bubble. Huh. But like, who do we, who stage did we go to second? I don't know, but we're heading this one. Just. Hope for the best. If it's ball crab, I know it's the spin wheel. Which it is. Okay, phenomenal. Again, I, like, I'm pausing to load stuff up so you know it's getting serious here. But again, we just gotta hope we don't instick ourselves on the spikes up top. And after that, it's literally a matter of just hope and pray. <laughs> yes, yeah, so, so his back and forth thing. Definitely gonna be a bit of a pain. Again, I just wonder how we can actually make this work. Because he clearly don't like us. Okay, so those things in the water, they are... Okay, that, that's something that's something that's happening, I suppose. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna ask. I'm not gonna ask. But that's what, that's what, like, our guaranteed boss out of the way. So now it's weather control guy and the other one that I forgot about. Man, okay, this is getting, like, this is getting exciting. Again, part of me is now, like, cursing past me for not having a look at the, um, the pellets, because I could have got them for the, um, the what's it called? Um, sub tank, even. Obviously, it wouldn't be much, but it'd be at least something, you know? Uh, but, like, maybe, maybe we get a boost for the final one? I don't know. So, I'm gonna get in this one and just pray I recognize them. If I can remember that for attack patterns, we're Gucci. I, um, you go p-toop, 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 don't you? What works well against you? It's not gonna be the bubble. Is it speed? It, it might be speed slicer. How much do I want to bet that it's speed slicer? Oh, why, when did I fight this guy? I said it was doable with the X Hunter. I think I think this guy is the, the slicer and I did it without. Yeah, no, because I did it Buster only, didn't I? Yeah, so if I can. Just out of interest, can I? Okay, so I can do that. Fun. Okay, well, that, that was kind of guaranteed hit, but I think, in general, this isn't the worst idea anyone's ever had. It's just one of them. Okay, so this is actually, like, perfectly working out for us. Little, I love his little thoop noise he makes when he fires stuff off. It's, like, admittedly kind of funny. So. Bonk. Nope. Leave me be. Leave me be, even. It, get it? it it's because you're made of... Um, achievement unlocked, half the sponge he used to be. I know what that is, but we're alive. Barely. Okay. And then with those mini refills, we got a tiny bit left. There he is. I, 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 I'm, I'm dreading this. Like, I actually have a good feeling of dread in my stomach, because it's like, I don't know. He has to be weak to bubble splash, is the, uh, is the working theory, obviously. It's like, again, we got a decent bit of, I say decent. We just need to know what his thing is, but I fought him so early on. Wait, no, the second... I'm trying to think. Yeah, we, no, we fought Bubble Crab, so this, was, this must have been the third guy we fought. 
First go with Fort Second Episode. Oh, this is hell. What would be his name? I'm trying to think. And then by that I mean I'm just gonna scroll through the thing. Um so morph morph no flame stack, that's it. Okay. I think I think we're just gonna have to try and brave flame stack on the very minimal almost like I don't know, a like backstreet setup we have. I think he is the one to go for. Even though I hate the fact we have to fight him. So he's gonna do that, then... Yes, yeah, so he's always gonna be doing this then, right? No, okay, we need to... Sorry, I did not even have Bubble Splash selected. That's horrid. Oh, that goes along the wall, right? That makes it help... That makes it even worse. Okay, but luckily, this does let us get at him from a range. So there's that, but there's also that. I should have anticipated that. But can we... Do we get multiple tries on that? Because we do. I forget the fact that was all on one life. So now we go again. <laughs> a bit more dripped out. Oh, I should have got the stuff for the bleeding thing. Okay. This time, we're going to get really, really mean. Okay, no. And it selects bubbles. Okay, so, yeah, he's always going to try and collide with us, isn't he? Okay, so, if I... I'm trying to think of, like, the best place to stand at and d attack him, but... I think, generally... Okay, and then he's going to... So, I need to dodge that. I wonder, can I... What if happens if I charge this up and use it on him? Will that, will that be... Does this make... Okay, it doesn't make me invulnerable. It just makes me... Damage things I directly run into, which is, you know, it's it's a change of pace. <laughs> oh no, it does it does it does help me actually. Um, because, uh, dear viewer, I've just realised how this helps. It stops him from grabbing me and pal driving me. And oh, I got the uh, that that I I'm really actually happy with myself. I was able to beat those all on one life. I'm pretty sure somebody else has done it before, but that feels like a decent bit of personal improvement, at least to me. So here we go. Sigma. It has been a while, Mega Man X. Mega Man. What? Sigma? It seems that the X Hunters have failed, but don't worry. I have arranged for some new toys for you to play with. If one of those toys was going to be Zero, sorry to break the news to you. It ain't happening. Oh, we got him. Okay. Oh, well, I'm definitely like, just going to scroll down to see. Um, Fire. This computer, is it? No, I mean, that's Sage. Again? Okay. So, we just... I think we dip one of the things. So, in case we're wondering for the weakness, um, reflects almost all of weapons except the strike chain, insta-kill thing, and level 3 or higher X-Buster shots. Let's do it. I just hope there's a thing for me to charge my um, sub-tanks in here, because if not, I may cry. Okay, it's this stage again. But he's going to be at the end of it instead. Is it? Is it... Okay, literally, it's the same things. So, he, wait, so how is he alive then? Because we, I, I know he said, I have many versions and me, 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 you know, at the, at the end of the last game, in, in, that, in that exact manner. Um, but it's like, I, how in the hell is he alive? Should I, is, it, should, is this something I should just get used to, Mega Man fans? I'm sure, I'm sure, I'm sure you guys will have the answers. Um, either way, we do have this, unfortunately. Like, there must be, I mean, that works. Okay. And then, it, 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 this is, is this literally just the stage we've already played? <laughs> Um, with with twists or without twists? That's my main question. But for a final stage, I'll take it, because this is easily the one that gave me the biggest ass port, like, ass whooping, you know? So I believe it's this, this, and I'll try and... Uh, let's see if I can knock this one out. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Okay, so knocking out those purple boxes is always satisfying. And then I'm just going to make sure to hit that, hit you. Okay, so things do seem a bit generous on the drops here, which I'll take. Um, obviously, it's not going to max out my, uh, my charges, but it'll... Uh, It'll get me somewhere. No, I, okay, that was really weird there. I'm not sure what I was expecting, but something else would probably be the answer. And don't be... Oh! Aya. You are alive. Okay, what? I have your parts. Look who I found wandering around, Mega Man. My friend here has a small problem with you. It seems that you let him die, and he's not too happy about that. Now, I think it is time that she repays the favor. Achievement unlocked, zero squared. Mm. Sigma, 
You should have studied the blueprints closer. There is only one Zero. Wait, Zero, I know your secret. You are destined to follow me. Maybe so, but I still don't like you. <laughs> Fine, if you will not follow me, then I'll just watch you die. <laughs> Once again! Okay, okay. If you want to be that way, be that way. Zero! Sorry to keep you waiting, Mega Man X. The greetings will have to wait. This is the slowest text scroll in the world, I'm sorry. We've got to defeat all the Mavericks, including Sigma. I'll take out the main computer, and you follow Sigma. Let's go. I am aware Sigma sounds nothing like- Oh! Here it is, X. Sigma lies just ahead. Uh, right, is that a bottomless pit that I meant to jump into, or...? Okay, it is. Whee! It's gonna be spikes at the bottom, and it'll be really mean, won't it? <laughs> With a lead dash. As a treat. Anyway, so we should probably pull out the strike chain just for just for fun measure. And I think are we here? I think we are. Okay, I have no, I've read his weakness, but I don't know his patterns. Just to clarify, you are merely a bothersome insect, Mega Man X. It is about time that I crush you beneath my heel. Ah, and he's wearing iron stilettos too. Watch out! What in the mother? What in the mother? Why is he doing this? How is he doing this? This is the strike chain, is it not? Okay, why is he playing ping pong with me? I'm, I'm not... Okay, um, we're gonna go to the regular X buster here, because clearly I don't know what's going on. Okay, so I, I can shoot you then, but just not with the strike chain? I... Maybe I misunderstand. Okay, and then he does that. I, This feels like a fight which I've got absolutely no chance of winning in. Okay, I'm gonna cut back in here. I, I had an aerobic moment, admittedly. Um, turns out the thing I was trying to use in the minutes is weakness is his phase two weakness. Um, what we actually need to do is the Sonic Slicer. Apparently that's, that makes more sense. Um, again, we're all on sub tanks, so I think this is definitely just a bit of a learning experience, but we're here. You know, we're here, so we'll beat him eventually. I have no doubt. It's just getting those damned attacks down. And is this a remix of something from the first game? Anyway, so you're merely an insect, X. It's about time to kill you with my iron stilettos or something. So, so he, he's, he's really hasty on that whole front, I will admit. But this... Okay, so, like, I can... Okay, so I can kind of see how this is going down. But well, I say kinda. I, I I don't know his his whole um grabby thing. I so like yeah. So he's trying to play ping pong with me essentially, isn't he? Again, if I can knock him. I mean, initially it was his dog in the last game. So I think if we were to uh, I wonder. Can I? What happens if I charge this up? Oh okay. Oh okay. Right. Fun. Um. So does this deal more damage? And then we die. Okay. Um. I'm gonna redo that again. Um. So he gains that attack later on, but Sonic Slice was his weakness, good to know. Again, we're kind of backed against the wall here, like literally. Um, and then he's gonna, yeah, so, oh, he always grows the yellow when he's about to do that then, interesting. And then I think we've got one more thing left, bam, okay. So that's first phase done, it only took a whole health gorge. Now for the second. <laughs> do we go all in and use our thing or do I try and like fill them up using I don't know, easy, easy to farm enemies. I don't know. But, and we'll read his dialogue here first, because this is the first time I'll be seeing it. So. Oh! Oh, I, I thought that, I thought that'd be dialogue. I thought that, I thought that'd be dialogue. <sighs> so obviously that's um, gone completely out the window. Uh, basically, in Bubble Crab's stage, there is apparently a place where if we were to, um, you know those hidden areas where I kept saying, huh, with stuff like, okay, I was a bit more aggressive about it. But, um, okay, the, the plan is to die, by the way. Um, I'll go show it off. Uh, basically, in the first game, in case you don't know, right before Sigma, the stage was that you climb the elevator shaft, fight Sigma and his dog, which is like, well, it is what it is. The issue is, is that it gave you these little worm things that you could farm with the boomerang item for a good while. 
and um, when you farm them, plenty, plenty a, a happy time or had, shall we say? Can I, can I get, can I get detected, please? Thank you. So we die now, Coolio, whatevs. Um, I can go back to fight at any time, so long as I don't close the game, um, because otherwise I've got to go back through all those stages, which is not very nice, is it? But um, if we were to head on to Deep Sea Base, Boss Bubble Crab, um, there is an area where apparently if we charge up Silk Moth's thing, we just get basically surrounded with all the delicacies of the ocean, uh, by which I mean uh, health heals and stuff like that, which I think is pretty neat. <laughs> Okay, so we can head to that. And, uh, and, oh, actually, that's a, that's a good start. <laughs> it, it, every little helps. Every little helps. Yeah, gotta. Sometimes you know, want not have not or something like that. So can I? Oh, I can do this. But don't I take damage if I do this? Yeah. Okay. I'm an, I'm an, I'm a bona fide idiot, is what we've learned. Uh, but um, anyway, can I? So if I were to just wait this out, there is a little thing that will come up. Nope. Yeah, I'm just gonna break this because I'm I'm bored and you annoyed me um, in my first playthrough of this stage. But I believe if we were to uh, oh let's take out the finners here as well. Why not? Why not? Anyway, here it is. So there's a little hidden room in here, and you may think, well, it's just a room. You'd be entirely right. If not, if we were to charge this up, we get this and um, friendly neighborhood Mega Man that fills up a whole sub tank. Can we do that again? Just out of interest, is that? Ah, and we do that, and 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 then when we're done, we just exit the stage. What well, saves me time? Um, <laughs> I expected like a few to appear, not not three cycles. You know, finish it for I. Baffled, baffled would be the word. But I would like to thank you, random user on Game Facts, that's currently covered up by my OBS um, overlay. Um, let's do this then. I think this one's going to be the one. Or if not, get very damn close. Again, I think having the strike chain definitely going to help. Well, can I? There we are. So, oh, right. Well, I'm an idiot, clearly. Um, well, it's fine. We'll make, we'll make up the health elsewhere, I'm sure. Um, okay, nothing there. Basically, we just got to hope we can top up that tiny extra bit of health because every little will help. Although having zeros, not zero, um, Sigma's own like enemies refills. Oh, that was cathartic before. Again, it's just a matter of getting a bit better at the formula now. But that is all pretty much maxed out. As long as we don't die and go wasting our health, it's pretty much guaranteed victory here. It's like, it's not even making noise because it doesn't need to, it's full. So I think it's the first time these support guys have been full, but shout out to that random game facts guy. Um, seriously, you should be considered a national hero. That is like, you did public service there, you know? <laughs> anyway. So again, we can spam through all this. It's, it's weird that the vile group plays. It's like, I could act through again, but you know, we'll give the, we'll give the abridged version. I can't believe that you are here. I have found Zero, and now he dislikes you. Ah ha 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 ha. You are going to fight now. No, you're not. It's me, Mega Man Zero. Real. You should have read the blueprints. Whatever this means, there's only one me. And by the way, he had the wrong colors. Still had the weird gems on the chest, though, that I'm sure definitely serve a purpose and are just not tits. Uh, I, we are best friends. Please kill Sigma while I punch the floor and cause a very big hole. And that's the last we saw of Zero ever. He he, he consequently left the franchise. I, I'd be surprised if Zero actually dies for permanent in any of these games. Like, I've seen I've seen too much fan art of him on Twitter. That man definitely permeates every aspect of this franchise going past the 90s, I assume. <laughs> He's like Shadow, you know, it's like he was initially meant to die and then they brought him back once as a treat and then they brought him back again as a surprise and then after that it just kind of became, after that it just got a bit mental, you know? <laughs> anyway, it's me, let's do this. So, well that's a bit mean, but, okay, so immediately... I don't understand how. Well, no, I understand how this works, but oh my word! Okay, why he he he's moving quicker than he was before. That much is for certain. Okay, seriously, no. Like, so can I jump over him when he does that? Because that's like my main pet peeve. Is like this man just gets like free hit after free hit. Um, although, panic firing this and just letting it ricochet for me, not the worst idea I've ever had. You know, it's like in the top like five worst idea. Nope, I knew it was gonna happen. It was, it was fabled from second one. 
Okay, that was just mean, considering I have very little time to actually act on that. And then just jump up over that, and then you go yellow, but it's fine. May have cost us, like, a decent bit of our health, but we have more health. Although we are going to immediately heal the second the pause menu becomes available, because... Bleh. Also, we need to pull better anyway to swap to the strike chain, which I think is more effective to use in the early... Th Actually, no, I'm going to shake things up. I'm going to keep it on the X-Buster for this... So, okay, so that's a decent bit of health it heals. I'm going to keep it on this, on the X-Buster. On pure account of, earlier on, it would make a bit more sense before he goes a bit mental, you know? So. So that... Okay, so how do I dodge that? That's, like, my main question for, for the court. How in the hell do I dodge that? It's like, I can, I can jump up here, but it's never, like, majorly guaranteed, you know? Although... <laughs> well, his own troops are feeding me. It's it, it's very scrumptious, I'll admit. Hang on, if I can get him while he's on the ground, I think that may actually be a smart choice. But I think as it stands, I may actually just have to take the the hits as they come. Because he loves eating them. Well, eating the shots. But I think this, is, this isn't the worst idea I've had. It's definitely been worse. <laughs> It's like, I think, I think, yeah, for the charges I can't fully charge, send, send, spend those on the enemies. But when not, you know. Yeah, so it, it's only fully charged X-Buster shots, unfortunately, which is... Ooh, okay, so we got him to go blue at least, you know? Okay, and ooh, so we can hide right in the corner and uh, deal with him that way, I believe. That, or oh, that was a very lucky... No, okay, so that was, that was just like a one-time thing that happened to them. But we definitely were able to... St okay, so maybe it's just that left corner. I don't... <laughs> I don't know. He's he's an enigma of a little man, you could say. Okay, so... Hmm. No, can I get that, please? Thank you. Okay, um... Definitely going without strike chain, though. I'm gonna say it right now. I think... Yeah, so this, that corner's fine. Uh, okay, uh, yeah, so it, I can't get the pot shots off on him, which is kind of a bit... I'm not sure what to call it. It's like, it, it's inducing panic. Um, so, we're gonna go again on the sub tanks. Use the forbidden fuel. Um, he's blue, you know, at least. I suppose I can give him that much. I just, I don't, I'm not a fan of this. Uh, mainly because I don't see much of a way to dodge this unless I, like, purely cling to the wall. Which may, okay, yeah, that, that, would, that would be perfectly fine if he um, also could stick to a certain Y level. Okay, so I can jump over him in some instances then. It's just others. Okay, come on. Just load those up. Come on. Thank you for the kind health. Oh, that was beautiful. That was beautiful. Come on. Yeah, okay. Seriously? Do it, doing that, like, mouth thing at me? Nah. As if. Come on. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Seeming it didn't mean to do a lot of things in this fight, but... Okay, so I can do this. It's just... No, I hit the, fa the top of his fat ass head still hits me. God, like I wouldn't be surprised if he was bullied in school. That is really annoying. Um, all right, so I suppose strike chain gets pulled out now because otherwise, when the hell will it? <laughs> like, okay, and then like it, like strike chain works as best it can. Okay, bump. Okay, just gotta, just gotta stick with this, honestly. I think, hmm, maybe, maybe if I go back to being Xbox, just for a second. Oh, yeah, okay, seriously, I can't fathom how I meant to dodge that laser attack. It's just, it's a little bit mean, that, innit? And, oh, don't think, no. That was perfectly within reason to fire. Okay, and then, okay, so this is an annoying little bird thing, don't he? Okay, and now he now he goes invis. Okay, this is when I think the strike chain probably is at its uh, at its strongest potential capacity. Nope. Okay, he's gone red now. Come on, if I can keep that up, I think we got I think we got something. Come on. Wait, what? Oh. Damn it, I wasn't I wasn't on the right bus. Damn it. That could have been something really good there, but it wasn't. Cause I'm an idiot. Okay, 
Okay, I think I've got the timing down for when he's going to respawn in at the very least. Don't understand what that was, but it works. No, don't freeze. Don't freeze. Oh! <gasps> Achievement unlocked. It's really over. That's why it lagged. Bam! <sighs> Cry about it. And I'll see you in the Shadow Realm. Mega Man X, I have lost you again. Each defeat only makes me stronger and serves to bring you closer to your ultimate doom. But something is not right. I don't quite understand. Why did Zero... He is the last of the Doctor's creations. Which one was like five? Ah. Oh, I hurt my throat to do. I have not hurt my throat voice acting since the old Ace Attorney Let's Plays. Um, my computer's starting to freeze though. Please stop spawning stuff on screen. I really hope the game doesn't crash now. Actually, I got the Steam achievement. It's technically over. Look at me go. Look at me go. Oh! We were in danger for a second, but we outran it. And what credit scroll have we got this time? Where is the one? I don't know. Uh, stars, I assume. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, nothing else really looks like that, does it? Yeah, clearly the sky. What's going on though? Is these, are these the credits? Are these the credits? Oh, it's zero. Hello. When can I play as you? You seem really sick. Okay. Oh, credit scroll. Um, I'm gonna give it a few seconds to start in. But I am about for those of you still engaged with this whole bet through wine. Just under 16 hours before it was due to be um, fulfilled or fulfilled. I was due to run out of time. We nailed it. So, um, with um, Thing by his side, Sigma was destroyed, uh, but X wonders if the fighting will truly end. I did not realize it went off screen there, I thought it went the whole way up. When Dr. Light's dream of a world in which Reptoids and humans live together in peace, merely a dream? I do not know. I mean, the bad ones seem to be gone, so there's that. The price of peace is often high, X thinks to himself. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it took like a week to stop the war, yeah, it's not too bad, you know? Who or what must be sacrificed for it to become reality? Oh. Yeah, definitely baiting a sequel, ain't you? It's not like, it's not like the six of the games left in this franchise for me to beat, nah, nah, nah. Um, and when the time comes, will he be able to do it? Um, I don't know. Depends on how difficult the game is. The future holds the answers, or... Or? 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 Huh. Ah. Okay, well, we're riding a motorbike. This song seemingly jams, but I'm going to do the outro now and we'll talk about opinions on the game afterwards. So if you have enjoyed this one, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, it'll help so much. Let's know you want to see more of this and all of that good stuff. I know you're watching this. I do not owe you a trip to Weatherspoons. Yes, that's what the bet was actually for. I speed around this entire game throughout a week, beyond what I normally would, to save myself seven pounds. You can pay for your own meal. With that said, thoughts on this game? Didn't enjoy it as much as the first. Like, I don't know. It... <sighs> Maybe it's because I sped through it super quick, but I, th I did like a few things. I liked things like there was more unique interactions and second phases in the bosses. I liked that. Fuck the computer stage, though. Um, those crushy blocks and the spotlights and the falling blocks and the boss that gets stronger by scanning you. None of that. But it was still fun. It's still all right. But in terms of the first game, I definitely still like the first game more. Um, I do appreciate that, at the very least, um, you know, those hidden areas did turn out to have a purpose. They weren't just there for the sake of being there. Um, yeah, no, it definitely seems to have a few more stage unique things. Obviously, they brought back the mech thing. They had the bikes riding the here as well. But it was honestly kind of fun. And, ah, uh, they list the, um, yeah, they list the stats of the things, don't they? So apparently Morph Moth was the weakest, which I buy. 
you know, stuff, stuff like lighting him on fire and stuff I did quite like. Like, the gameplay is functionally the same, like, the UI controls and stuff are the same. The main thing I don't like is the control scheme. X to hold and fire is fine, as is B to dash, but um, when dash jumping is required, or worse, I'm combining that with, like, the flame charge to get extra stuff, I'll hold it like that. So it's, like, got two fingers on these and then um, on that X you're holding that. Awkward. I know you can remap it, but, like, I want to make the point that, like, that should be accounted for in the default control scheme. I have heard people say that they map the fire button to, the, like, the right trigger. Which would make a bit more sense, I suppose. Like, yeah, I can definitely see myself pulling that maneuver a bit more, but... Default control scheme. Ah, uh, no. And, ooh, they do not know what Zero's power or speed is. And me is Mega Man X, in which my power and speed are also unknown. Um, I'd be lower than everything else in this game, seriously. The amount of outtakes in this series, I haven't even edited most of it, will be sky high. But, thanks for playing, presented by... The Game Freezing for 10 Seconds! and giving me a Steam achievement. The price of peace is often high. Presented by Capcom. Thank you, Zero. I will not have been able to tell otherwise. And I think that's it. Wait for it to fade to black just to see if it gives me any extra additional stuff. We'll see. You gonna... Any post credit scene this time? And if not... I think that's it. A, B, that, 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 all do nothing. So once again, thanks for watching. See you in the next game. May have code commentary for it, may not. We will see. Until next time. Well, said all that aside, thanks for watching, guys. My name's been Ramic and Peace. Out.